and thank you for coming to your Sango City News for today on this December 10th, 2017. For this breaking news for today, I am John Burgundy going live here for today at the Sango City um, News Center for today on this Channel 5 News. And uh, today joining with me is Shane Wood. Uh, tonight's uh, topic is Sango City looking a lot like Christmas uh, at this time of the year. Christmas is coming up close and Christmas shopping deals are going in and around town uh, during this week and uh, right before uh, Christmas itself. So get those deals done once uh, when Christmas is done. They will be having uh, New Year's deals and more events will be coming into town uh, then. Uh, next topic of news for today is Legotopia present uh, making um, it illegal to smoke uh, marijuana. A new law uh, that was uh, just uh, established or uh, made uh, this uh, last week. Um, which um, some people are furious with the new law, but uh, President Carter Chavez says uh, that this law will uh, help fix um, uh, unhealthiness with uh, people in the San Jose City area. Uh, so that's another topic of tonight's news for today on the Sunday Night News. And uh, San Jose City Police Department is reporting or did report a shooting on Wednesday night at the San Jose City Ice Rink. Uh, there was a shooting suspect named James Brown, they believe. And he was detained, killing, um, almost killing seven uh, uh, civilians that were at the ice rink. Uh, but those seven civilians were injured. Uh, police all, uh, did have uh, false news over it, uh, saying that the seven people who were injured were uh, dead. Uh, but they are in the San Jose City Hospital right now. And San Jose City Police Department is um, having a uh, campaign to uh, stop these shootings from happening in the San Jose City area. Uh, next topic of news for today, Sango City weather hotter than average. Uh, we're seeing temperatures go up to 75 degrees and also 24 degrees with its low uh, just a while ago with such snow showers actually. But the high during this month and last month was 75 degrees which is a uh, very uh, unusual weather to see at this time of the year. Um, so that's a big problem that is going on during uh, or not just here but across the world. Um, next topic of news for today, in the USA, California on fire, five fires reported uh, destroying um, famous homes um, up in um, the Los Angeles area. Five fires were reported, and these fires are getting very, very deadly. Um, they said uh, the, of the California uh, Fire Department did report that. Um, so they are saying that those houses will be are getting destroyed at this moment most likely. Uh, we will be going live at the San Jose City North Pole with John Lee and Santa Claus himself. Uh, we will be joining back with John uh, John Lee right now at the San Jose City uh, North Pole. Uh, thank you, um, John Burgundy and Shane Wood, for uh, joining me here for today at the Sango City uh, North Pole today. Uh, today at the North Pole, some events are going on at the local North Pole here at the Sango City International uh, Park, actually. And um, we are, I am joined with for today as Santa Claus himself is joining with me for today. Um, please, Santa Claus, tell how you are getting your gifts ready for the season. Um, yes, of course, uh, we are uh, getting uh, the gifts um, for the kids in the area for today. And me as Santa Claus himself of this 2017 year, we will be, uh, me and my elves will be uh, working as hard to get these gifts uh, to these kids. Uh, Legotopia kids as you call it and um, to the people of the world for today at this uh, beautiful Santa Claus area of North Pole um, so uh, we are here for today and uh, we are here uh, to be Santa Clauses all around the world and me as Santa Claus will um, will do as much as possible uh, to for these people uh, in the area so ho 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 to everyone out there and very Merry Christmas to those kids of course out there um, thank you, Santa Claus, for uh, presenting that for us for today. Uh, so that is uh, Santa Claus right there, folks. Um, it's a very beautiful area out here for today. Um, if you want to check out the North Pole, it is at the San Jose City International uh, Park or Forest here uh, right behind the San Jose City Capitol Building. And President Carter Chavez will be visiting the North Pole uh, during this month, most likely. Um, Santa Claus is offering uh, gift plans to those parents and deals to those parents out here uh, for today. And also he is selling some of his uh, local made gifts uh, to the San Jose City Christmas store in the uh, capital downtown area. So please join them then for today. And I am John Lee presenting this uh, live feed for today at the San Jose City North Pole at Channel 5 News.
And thank you, John Lee, for presenting that uh, live feed right there at the North Pole for today. Uh, next on the news for today is San Jose City Red Bricks have lost the season, uh, making them 4-10 and with their last uh, record for uh, the season of um, the NFL, Legotopia NFL season. And he lost uh, the last, or the San Jose City Red Bricks uh, coach did lose uh, their last game on this day for today and will not be going to the playoffs um, this year. So uh, we will be seeing who does go to the Super Bowl. Uh, number four is this year for the San Jose City Legotopia NFL, which will be held at the San Jose City MHS. Let's go to uh, check out your San Jose City Doppler radar and five day forecast for today. Here's your San Jose City 5 day for or Doppler Doppler radar, sorry about that, at the uh, on 12 10 2017 for today at the Sango City area. We're seeing some uh, lingering showers and snow showers in the area of Sango City uh, for tonight. Um, in the Sango City Bay and the part of the ice rink, we are seeing some lingering snow showers, not too heavy, but if you're entering into town, some of the roads are a little bit silk or a little bit slippery uh, entering into town or slushy um, entering into town right over there at the entrance of Sango City. Right on the south side of Sango City, we're seeing some lingering uh, rain showers and some heavy snow showers uh, just outside of Sango City area right there. And also parts of Sango City area, this is the bigger, biggest storm so far that we have seen in the Sango City area at this part of it. Um, we're seeing some lingering snow showers that did hit part of the Sango City uh, International Airport, but not seeing too much activity at the Sango City Airport, uh, International Airport um, at all. So uh, no delays are going on. The at the Sango City Airport, but if you are going and entering uh, the Sango City Airport, there might be some delays uh, going on the highway to the Sango City Airport. Uh, that is your Doppler radar for today. Now let's go check out your five-day forecast for today. Here's your five-day forecast for today in the Sango City area for today. Thank you for joining us on this five-day forecast. And uh, on this uh, Sunday for today in the Sango City area, uh, we are seeing some lingering showers, uh, which is um, some snow showers in the area with 35 degrees, of course. Um, sorry, I need to flip the camera real quick. Sorry about that, guys. Um, but it is Sunday uh, for today with sunny and snow and flurries with a high of 35 degrees. Monday on your first day of your work week is sunny with 50 degrees with its high. E getting even warmer on this Tuesday and Wednesday with 65s clear and 60 on uh, Wednesday. And then getting a little bit colder by the end of your work week uh, with a uh, clear uh, sunshine still. But uh, getting colder with 45 degrees with that cold front moving in with precipitation chance of 10%. Uh, by the end of uh, your work week on Friday right before uh, Christmas break for those kiddos. Uh, they will be seeing some uh, lingering snow showers during that week too in the San Jose City area. That is your five-day forecast for Channel 5 News on uh, today. And thank you for coming to our San Jose City Channel 5 News for today for um, this 12-10-2017 uh, on December 10th, 2017 for today. And thank you folks for watching your Channel 5 News. If you have any additional questions, please go to our local website at channel5news.com. And thank you for watching today's uh, tonight's news. And stay safe out there, folks.